Yo, what it do YouTube? My name is Chad. Welcome back to another episode of Skyline Smoke Plan. And you talk about the title of the video today. I am very excited. The herb we're going to be reviewing and smoking today is a herb that's been highly requested for a very long time. So yeah, today we are smoking Clip Daga, or as they say in South Africa, we are smoking Clip Daha. Okay, but before we get into that, I just want to say, guys, there's some big news. As you could tell, as you guys can see, as you can tell by the but my hoodie, we now have merch, Skyline Smoke Blends merch via Teespring. So I'm going to leave a link in the description if you guys want to check it out. We have uh, hoodies, sweatpants, unisex t-shirts, t-shirts for women. And a lot more stuff going to be coming soon, okay guys? So if you guys are interested, the link in the description will be to the Teespring, all right? If you guys want to check out the merch and whatnot, all right? Now, let's get into this, okay? Because I'm, I'm actually quite excited. Today, not only will, will, will we be smoking... Uh, we'll be smoking Clip Daga, like I said, but for you today, I have Clip Daga, the, the regular dry herb. I also have the Clip Daga petals, the flower petals. So we're going to be smoking both of them, all right? And just like I said, as usual, this is your first time to the channel. What we're going to be doing is we are going to smoke the herbs. I'm just going to tell you guys how it tastes, how it smells, and pretty much how I'm feeling in the, whatever my experience is in the moment, okay? So I have one joint rolled up here, which is purely the, the flower petals. And I have one joint of rolled up here, which is the pretty much the dry herb, okay? And I got my Sherlock Holmes pipe, that I love very much. Now, the first thing I noticed, right, when it comes to when I was smelling the herb, right, was how good it smelled. The petals itself, ooh, wow, it smells so good. It's such a, it's almost like it's such a, lem it's like a lemony floral scent, like a floral lemon, almost like how I'll say, I'll say similar to like lemon balm, but not really. Uh, if, if I could you, if I could describe it using an adjective, I would say that it smells happy. That's how it smells. It smells happy. It doesn't make sense, but it smells really good. The dry herb, on the other hand, totally different experience. When you smell it, you get a little bit of the same smell of like kind of like a lemony floral scent. But I would say it's kind of like a basil too. Which, yeah, kind of almost like a basil, which is interesting. But just similar smells. This one smells a little bit more like a basil. That makes sense. Okay. So one thing with the petals too, right? Which is really cool. I don't know if you guys have seen my, my Wild Daga smoke review. But literally, these petals... Oops, excuse me. Making a mess. I don't know if you guys can see that. But, if you guys see it better in the light. But these petals, uh, they're, similar, they're, they're the exact same color because... Clip Daga is pretty much the cousin, the cousin plant of Wild Daga, right? So that the petals are very soft, very soft uh, consistencies, uh, closer to like a mullein on the spectrum. Whereas um, this, this herb over here, it's very dry. It's very dry. I actually need to like break it apart. I didn't put it into a grinder, but I, just, I had to break it apart before I rolled it in because it was so, so dry. Like I said, I'm very excited. You know, one thing people ask me is, Hey, where, where do you get your herbs from? So one particular company that I really do uh, like getting the herbs from is a company called, the, the name is Schmerbel's Herbals. I'll say it again, it's Schmerbel's Herbals, all right? They're based out of Connecticut and North Carolina. Good for them, two locations. And they sell, they, like I said, they sell these herbs. Uh, they actually have a website and the website is uh, shmerbles.com. Maybe, maybe I'll put the link in the description, but I don't know. They're, they're not they're not sending me that, that Shmerbles Herbals money, so I don't know if I'll do that. But here's this, uh, if you guys can check it out, that's the, um, that's their logo, and that's their website, if you can see it, okay? Um, ask me, I'll put it in the comments, all right? But no more wasting your time, all right? We're gonna get into smoking this right now. So this is how we're gonna run it down. We're gonna smoke one joint with the petals, one joint of the dry herb. We're gonna do one one bowl of the flower petals, one bowl of the dry herb, and then we do an additional bowl mixing the both of them together. Okay, so let's get into it. We're gonna start with the petals, okay? Because why not? Okay. One thing about this herb, uh, if you want to talk about it like medicinally for a second, right?
they used to use um actually they used to they still do they use klebdaga pretty much as like as like a remedy to treat like fevers headaches asthma they also say it helps uh with like um gastro problems and stuff with the stomach they say that um it helps with snake bites so if you guys ever get uh, bit by a snake you have klebdaga on you you know figure it out It's also a, um, how you say, an anti-inflammatory, excuse me, both burp, excuse me. It's also an anti-inflammatory herb, which means that uh, you, you can put, you can make this herb into a tincture. And then um, let's say like, you know, say it's people for, for people with arthritis, you rub it in, you know, let's say you have arthritis in the hand, you rub it into your hand, the elbow, pretty much if you have pain, like a joint pain, or you're inflamed, you can just make it to a tincture and rub it into, and it helps actually, helps release pain, which I thought was, Quite interesting. So I'm trying to get an idea of the flavor, so I'm just gonna keep hitting it before I, I get you um, a better idea. Um, it, as you can see, it doesn't, it doesn't create the thickest smoke. But like I said, this is this is just the the, um, the flower petals. I'm sure that the the dry herbs will be a whole different experience. I'm sure that the dry herbs. Gonna create a lot more of a thick smoke than the petals. That's my um, hypothesis right now. Okay. Whew. Now I'll think about it. You know these flower petals. Um, they it it kind of reminds me of the of the wild daga, honestly. That's what it kind of reminded me of. I guess like the, um, the taste and whatnot. But what does that mean? What does that mean that it tastes like wild dog? Because you never smoked wild dog before, you wouldn't even know what I'm talking about. Oof. I didn't mention what the effects were when you smoke club dog. <laughs> So pretty much people use it as an alternative uh, to smoking cannabis as well as tobacco. Pretty much they say it gives you like a happy euphoric feeling. Um, others saying it's also like a, like a calming sensation. So they say that Club Daga is better if you is better for smoking in terms of recreational use than the Wild Daga because Club Daga has more pseudo alkaloids and, and alkaloids, and those alkaloids are what gives the euphoric and happiness feeling. So I thought that was quite interesting. But they also say that when you mix Wild Daga and Clip Daga together and smoke it together, you get an even better experience. But that's not backed by science. That's just more of like um, what individuals say. But that's something that we could do in the future where we smoke Wild Daga and Clip Daga together. So maybe that's something we could, upcoming video, upcoming video. Quite nice. Oof. That is quite nice. Guys, at the time of recording this for video, we have just reached 400 subscribers, man. That's amazing. I started making these videos in, I think it was July. When I started making these videos in July, I would have never thought that, like, wow, I'm at 400 subscribers, man. That's pretty, it's pretty insane. That might not seem like a lot to some people, but I think anybody, like man, 400 people like 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 when I like my stuff, it's pretty crazy. Thank you for that. You know, I'm all, like I say, I'm always very grateful. It's quite nice, but in terms of the taste, um. I can't say that there's, there's one particular strong flavor that I'm getting. I'm smoking it, I'm feeling the heat on my tongue, and it's going to my throat, and that's pretty much it. They say it tastes like something, you know? I must, by no means, it's, it's not a bad flavor by any means, I just, 
I, I'm having trouble putting into words of what it actually tastes like, you know? Say what, it does not taste like beef stew. Thank you for your service. Your country loves you. Okay. On to the next one, which is going to be the same thing, but now it's the dry herb, right? Ooh. Wow. Whoa. Totally different experience. Whoa. Already, the flavor is completely different. I I I I have to take more hits to really explain it, but whoa, different experience already. Wow, that's really enjoyable. That is a really enjoyable smoke. Wow. Very smooth. Mm. Excuse me. I didn't, eat I, didn't, yeah, I didn't eat anything today, so I, I wonder if that will um, play 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 um, play a strong variable in how I'm feeling and whatnot. One thing that I guess I'm feeling right now in this moment is I I kind of feel like you know times when your when your face muscles they get relaxed and they almost feel kind of droopy. That's how I I feel a little bit right now. I feel like that very relaxed sensation in my face. I love this smoke, man. Oof. Yeah. So far, the dry herb is beyond better. So far. I would say that I am feeling uh, a sensation. I would say the sensation that I'm feeling right now in my head, like I said, you kind of feel like that, like that little bit of like that feeling. You're very light, almost kind of like slightly floating. Very slightly. Obviously, like, I'm still very cognizant, but I'm saying it's it's more of like a relaxed feeling where, I mean, you know, you, you get that lightheadedness, you know, and you're just, it's very, just, very nice, very nice feeling like this, you know, you're just very, just, basically say, like, I don't know, floating, but it's not floating, it's like lightheadedness feeling, you know? Can't get ash on, the, on a white hoodie, man. On the merch, Skyline merch, available at teespring.com, link in the description. Do you find something funny? I think it's just like a, like a behind, the, you say it's like a behind the scenes, something kind of like, oh, it's like a funny thing. So you, you guys, I, guess I always say like, um, I don't have an example right now, but I'm always like, oh, if you guys want, if I always say, hey, if you guys are interested in any of the products in this video, um, check out, the, I, I check out the link in the description. And when I post this, those are Amazon affiliate links, right? That you guys can go and purchase stuff and I receive a small commission from it, right? Uh, I actually got an email from Amazon and they said to me that, how do I say this in words? Uh, they have pretty much ended <laughs> because no one bought anything from the Amazon links. I'm no longer, I, I am no longer have, I, I no longer have Amazon affiliate links anymore. They don't fuck with me like that anymore, so. That was nice. Oof. I would say that I get a hint of a spice. There's a slight spice. That's, that's how I, I would, um, kind of describe the flavor of this one. It's like it's like your typical earthy earthy herb, right? Pop out, but it has a slight spice to it. A slight a slight spice you get on, on your tongue and a little bit of the throat. Um, 
Quite startling. like this for this thing it's just so enjoyable That's good news, guys. Hmm. Next week, next Friday, Black Friday. I'm actually going to be uh, going to like a going to a marketplace. It's like a vendor marketplace, and I'll be going there at Skyline Smoke Buns, selling herbs, which is pretty fucking cool, right? My first time selling. I'll be selling the herbs, selling the blend, in person at a marketplace, which is which is exciting, right? You know, and to think that this started. On here on YouTube, but you guys with your support, excuse me, you guys with your support, you guys let me know that wow, this is something that people are, are into, you know. So, yeah, I'm going next, going that, that it's this Friday. I don't know if you guys have ever heard of Jersey City, but that's where it's gonna be. I pay 60 bucks for a table, I don't even care about make, making the money, I just more care about like the experience and just uh, oh, being, being, being some interesting people. That was nice. On to the next one, as they say. So now we're gonna go load up this this bowl. All right, all right, very nice. Load this bowl with the flower petals. And we're gonna see what's up. Pipes are a little aggressive, man. Especially this one. Interesting. Smoking the petals out of this. Makes me excited for what's to come with the dry herb. Hey, what's up, guys? Just a quick reminder that now we do have our own specialized blends on the website, skylinesmokeblends.com. We have a different assortment of different kind of blends for your different needs. This one right here is my favorite. This is the Skyline Special, which is comprised up of different herbs that are going to give you a nice, legalized high that's just good for a good time and by yourself with your friends. Just want to chill out. This one's my favorite, all right? So thanks again, guys, and have a good one. Yeah, I'm uh, I'm feeling something. I am definitely like um you know, more of that spaciness in the head. I'm more just like a very relaxed, very relaxed feeling. Like I said the face, I feel like the face muscles are really relaxed and it's just really calm, really chill. That's how I I would explain everything right now. You know, one, one thing I'm, I'm always like, hey, Chad, maybe you should bring some water when you're doing these videos because you get thirsty halfway doing these things. I never bring water, you know? Oh. Please throw. You finish this up, and then we'll get to the next three. Yep. That's pretty much done.
Beautiful. All right, two joints down, one bolt down, two more bolts to go. Let's do it. Yeah, so just so you guys have an idea, this is how dry the herb actually is. It's very, very dry. I hope, I, I hope you guys can, I hope, I hope that's a good angle. You guys, fuck me. It happened again. I literally went and finished the video, went to check it out, and it didn't record everything. Very sad. I did smoke those two bowls, but now there's no proof of it. And uh, it's crazy. It's so trippy how I literally went. The video cut on me again, so you guys have an idea. I literally make the whole video. I go check it out, and it cuts out. And it literally cuts on me. And fuck me. You know, that's all I can say. But I did, I did smoke those two bowls. I did smoke those two bowls. I did. I'm not lying. But I feel like I have to do it again. So. <laughs> man, shit's crazy, man. It's just crazy because, like, like I said, I feel like it happened to me in the in the past, but it's like, like I said, you know, well, guys, when, when I do these videos, guys, I, I don't have a script. You know, I just come on here and I talk to you guys about, um, I talk to you guys about what, what, what I'm thinking and what, what, I'm, what I'm experiencing in the moment. So it's like, damn, for the video to cut, it's like, damn, I have to like, try to recreate it, but it's just like, damn, it's different. Like, like example, the video that you guys are seeing now, this, you guys are not now, it's like, you guys aren't seeing the original video anymore. This is, this is, this is a completely different video, if you think about it. Completely different video. What I have right in here right now, right, is the, is the dry herb from the Clip Daga and the pedals together, so... I'm gonna smoke it again, right? Cause uh, you guys didn't see it, but I am smoking it again, right? And um, yeah, we're just gonna see what's up, man. <coughs> Woo! That has a little tickle to your throat, man. <laughs> One thing I was saying before, I was saying was that um, this is a really good herb for people who just want to relax. I feel very relaxed. My face, I said the face relaxed. Lightheadedness in the, in the head. I was saying this is like a nice herb. One, I I see myself like smoking this and just like chilling on the couch and like watching TV or something, you know. I don't know if I mentioned it already because like I said two times in this video or like half the second time I'm recording the second half. I I definitely enjoyed the um the dry herb. Put that right there. Look at that. Yo, Schmerble Herbals. You guys have to sponsor me, man. Look at that. Look at that product placement, man. I definitely um enjoyed the dry herb. A lot more than the petals. So if anyone wants to interested in Club Daga, um, and you only want to buy one, buy the dry herb, okay? I think I, can, I, think I got to mention is that um, Wild Daga is also called Lion's Tail. Well, Club Daga is also referred to as Lion's Ear. So I, think I find that to be quite interesting. But yeah, guys, hold up. If you guys are interested in the clip dog that I, I used in today's video, uh, visit um, shmerbles.com. Like I said, ask me in the comments and I'll post the link in the description. And yeah, pretty much it, guys. I'm also, um, you know, the our, I think it was the Mugwort. The Mugwort Smoke Review, um, that, that's from this company as well. And what else have I bought? I, I bought that the Calazia Tea. I haven't done a review on that yet, but um, 
when I do, you guys will know that it's from this. And uh, you guys, big things to come, right? We'll be doing more smoke reviews, more tea reviews. I want to do uh, a, a second Blue Lotus wine review because uh, this time I want to do it with a better tasting red wine and I want to do it with a actual filter, I think a strainer, so it's not gross. And I will still do it on the ice because I'm a savage. Um, excuse me. Yeah, guys, that is pretty much it. Thank you once again. You know, like I always say at the end of the video, I'll send you it again right now, but um, we're at 400 subscribers, man. I'm so grateful for the comments you guys leave. You guys motivate me to make these videos, so thank you so much for that. And guys, until I see you in the next video, be safe, have fun, smoke herbs, all right? This is Kyle Smoke Blend, and I'm signing out. Peace.